Now, let us learn about the properties of carbon. One of the key properties of carbon that we wish to learn about is the allotropic nature of carbon. What is allotropic nature? Allotropy is the property of some of the elements that occur in nature in more than one form. The chemical properties of these different forms are the same, but their physical properties are different. And this ability to exhibit different forms is called as allotropy. That was about carbon, but sulfur and phosphorus also exhibit allotropy. Now, one may ask, what is the real difference between an allotrope and a chemical compound. Meaning, what is the difference between, let us say, carbon being able to exhibit allotropic form of diamond and graphite versus carbon exhibiting different compounds like carbon dioxide and carbon monoxide. What is the difference? Remember, chemical compounds have different chemical and physical properties. So, they differ in both of these cases. In case of allotropes, we are only talking about the difference in physical properties, but there exists a similarity in their chemical properties. One of the key difference between allotropes and compounds is that allotropes are of a single element. So it is only pure carbon that we are talking about here. Whereas in case of compounds or chemical compounds, it is the combination of multiple elements which gives rise to these chemical compounds. The chemical compounds may differ in chemical as well as physical properties. So please do not confuse allotropes with different compounds. Allotropy is the ability of some element that occurs in nature in more than one form.